God sent a message to Obadiah the prophet in a vision. God had news about a country called Edom. The people who lived in Edom were like brothers to the people in Judah. Both groups were descendants of Isaac's twin sons, Jacob and Esau. The people in Edom came from the family of Esau. God's people came from the family of Jacob. The people of Edom didn't love God. They worshiped false gods. They lived in the mountains and trusted the mountains and their own strength to protect them. The people thought that they were better than everyone else. The Edomites didn't get along with God's people in Judah. When the Babylonians took over the city of Jerusalem, the people in Edom just sat back and watched. They didn't try to protect Judah. The people of Edom even went into Jerusalem and took things that didn't belong to them. God said he was going to punish Edom. Listen up, God said. Out of all the nations, you will be the least important. No one will like you. You were proud and I will punish you. You thought you were safe, but I will bring you down. Obadiah's message for the people of Edom was bad news. God was going to allow Edom's enemies to take away everything they had. Even the people who were their friends would steal from them. Many people would be killed. God said to Edom, you were cruel to the people in Judah, so you will be punished. When Judah needed your help, you stood back and did nothing. You laughed and were happy that they were attacked. Every bad thing you did to others will be done to you. The day of the Lord is near, Obadiah warned. Every evil thing you did to others will be done to you. God said that the bad things that were happening to his people in Judah were only for a little while. God would deliver his people. But when I punish you, Edom, God said, everything will be destroyed. Obadiah's message from God had good news for God's people. My people will have the land that belongs to Edom, God said. God's people would return to their homes and God would take care of his people. But Edom's punishment was forever. Like God's people were mistreated by the people of Edom, Jesus was mistreated by his own people. God will punish sin. Jesus died on the cross to take the punishment we deserve for our sin. We can trust Jesus to make wrong things right.